have a slow up, no I don't take shit, I got no love for the fakeness If you wanna play tough and wanna hate this, I'll show up I don't ever slow up, no I don't take shit, I got no love for the fakeness CBS The Bold and the Beautiful Spoilers revealed that Ridge and Thomas will have a big argument over Brooke. The day after Brooke went to Thomas' house for a meeting and there was a big argument, she came back and told Ridge about this. Brooke said of a pitiful face that she had only come to Thomas to ask him not to take Douglas away, when hope was such grief that Thomas threatened her with a knife. When Ridge heard this, he completely trusted Brooke and went to confront Thomas. Then he also used this and he completely trusted Brooke and went to confront Thomas. And then he also used force to beat his son. Thomas tried to explain, but Ridge didn't believe him, and he was deeply disappointed in his father. Thomas was no longer weak, but sat still and let his father beat him like that. Through this incident, the relationship between the father and son will no longer be harmonious. It may even be cut off because of Brooke. Did Ridge soon realize he had wrongly blamed his son and came to apologize? Can they get along like before? Will Ridge know the truth soon, and what will happen? Meanwhile, everyone knows about Lee and Bill dating, but Steffi and Finn objected to this vehemently. Finn tried to convince Lee to break up because he wanted his adoptive mother and father to reunite. He didn't want anyone to come into this family. Lee didn't listen and decided on his own accord. Then Steffi stood up to advise Lee, and her reason is because she knows Bill's unfaithful and thinks he's a bad man. Even though Bill had saved Lee's life, both Finn and Steffi said he was not good and didn't want Lee to spend the rest of their lives with him. The fact that both Finn and Steffi objected made Lee very sad. Her life, she wanted to let herself choose. Most of the time she interacted with Bill, she also understood that he was like and not what people said about him. Not that Leah just experienced life and death once, she would decide to follow her heart and not listen to anyone's advice. Is Leah's choice the time correct? Will she regret coming to Bill later? Will the two of them continue to be happy? Besides, it looks like Carter and Quinn's love story will really end, but Carter still can't get over it. Quinn is with Shauna right now and she probably has no intention of getting back to Carter. Went a while, but hasn't returned. However, the truth is that Quinn was in a car accident and comatose. Shauna, having arranged for Quinn, returned to town to inform everyone, including Carter. Will Carter be this shocked when she finds out that she was in a car accident? Carter still loves Quinn very much, and he never expected this to happen to Quinn. He must be blaming himself now for not timely stopping and holding her back to let her happen like this. Carter will quickly fly over to Quinn and take care of her until she regains consciousness. Carter's love for Quinn is immense. This time, Carter will be determined not to lose Quinn again. How is Quinn's condition now? Will she soon wake up to Carter's care and love? And how will things turn out?